The Chef Summer Series coming to Hickory, the restaurant at the Nice Wander Inn. It kicks off this week and will feature four renowned chefs from across the nation. Kelly Grossfield live in Bristol, Virginia with executive chef Travis Milton with more on what will be featured in the series and how you can enjoy the feast. Good morning, Kelly. Hi, good morning, Casey. Yes, no, it is beautiful outside, so I thought we'd take you outside first before we head into the kitchen. But if you haven't been to Hickory, this is the chance to do it because we have an exciting sustainable chef series coming up. I'm joined now by executive chef Travis Milton, who this is your first time doing it here, right? Uh, here at Hickory, yeah, it's my first time doing it. We wanted to get, you know, everything kind of under our belt the first year and then start rolling in, getting some of my chef friends from out of town. And so. Uh... You have a long history with a lot of chefs, well-known chefs that you're bringing into the area. Talk about why you selected who's coming. Um, I really kind of wanted it to be uh, kind of Travis and friends, uh, for lack of a better term. So <laughs> I, I really got with some of uh, some of my best and closest chef friends, um, Brian Voltaggio, who will be here this week, Andrew Zimmern, who uh, he and I go way, way back. Uh, I've done a couple of bizarre foods with him. And then Ashley Shanti. Uh, Misty Norris, like it's it's an amazing it's, it's an amazing list this year. So so sustainable is in the title. I mean, that's really the focus for all of these series. There'll be four different series. Why is sustainable so important? And what do you hope people learn if they do come? Well, the, the, the thing that I really wanted to convey is there's different levels to it and different thought processes in it. You know, here at Nice Wander and here at uh, Hickory, we really try to to really push sustainability and work within that. Probably about 85% of all our ingredients come from either farms around here or our own farm, which you can see around us. Uh, and dealing with these chefs and working with them in the past, you know, there's been different levels. So with Brian, we're focusing on sustainable seafood because we work together in the Chesapeake Bay. And uh, with Ashley Shanti, we're working on, you know, Appalachian heritage stuff. And then with uh, Misty, Andy, and Tiffany in September, we'll be doing zero waste. Uh, so it'll be utilizing every single part of everything that we we work with so it's, it's really cool that's going to be something i need my kitchen because yeah. those are some <laughs> great tips to take home so when people do come out i mean is it five courses what can they expect yeah it'll be five courses uh each one of them um unfortunately the andrew zimmer one is sold out with the uh highlands festival but there's still some tickets for the brian voltaggio one as well as the ones in august and september um it'll be a lot of fun i usually do two courses they'll do two courses and my pastry chef uh taylor jarvis she knocks out an amazing dessert with it and uh who knows, maybe a couple of them you might get a little little special, you know, fifth or sixth, seventh course in there. So Well to me, food is a love language and especially the way you guys are doing it, literally farm to table and you're teaching through the food. Yeah. I mean, what do you hope people take home from this? My my uh, one of my biggest life missions and, and why I came back to Southwest Virginia to do hickory is to show people the value that we have in front of us in what Appalachian foodways are. It gets kind of glossed over or it's been, you know, forgotten in some families. Uh, and it's something that's intrinsically ours that, you know, these these techniques that we have down here that you don't see anywhere else in the country or even the world. And I want people to to see that. And a lot of those things were born out of preserving and, and not having waste and being sustainable because you had to. So showing people that there is tradition in that and it's something to take a lot of pride in. And something you do here, very different cooking style. We're going to take you into the kitchen later on in the newscast and show you some of the delicious dishes that they offer here. Just a little sneak peek if you're looking to come check out this summer series. Reporting live in Bristol, Virginia, Kelly Grossfield, ABC Tri-Cities.